class. Today we are going to be working on elapsed time. What is elapsed time? Elapsed time is time that is occurring or happening over a period of time. Okay? Let's read this word problem together. Here we go. It is 2.30 p.m. and Ray has to be in bed by 7.30 p.m. How many hours until Ray goes to numbers we're working with today. Yes. 2.30 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. Very good. 2.30 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. P.m. tells me what time of day. Who knows? Yes. Night. In the evening or in the night time. Very good because it says P. M. And what is my question that I want answered here? Yes. How many hours until Ray goes to bed? What is my starting point? Yes. My starting point is going to be 2.30. Now the first thing I'm going to do is jump by one hour. Okay? So I'm going to go from 2.30 p.m. right here to 3.30 p.m. You see that? Now I'm going to jump another hour from 3.30 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. Very good. 4.30 p.m. Do I stop or keep going? Keep going! I'm going to jump from 4.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. I'm going to jump from 5.30 p.m. to 6.30 Do I stop or keep going? Keep going! I'm going to jump from 6.30 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Do I stop or keep going? Stop! Very good. Find my answer. All I have to do now is add up all the hours that I have jumped in total. Okay? So we have one, two, three, four, five. So my answer is going to be five hours. How many hours until Ray goes to bed? Ray has five hours. Let's try another example of elapsed time. Quentin goes to track practice at 4.30 p.m. It is now 2 p.m. How long before Quentin goes to track practice? I'm going to draw my number line. What numbers am I working with? 4.30 p.m. and 2.30 p.m. 2 o'clock p.m. 4.30 p.m. and 2 p.m., not 2.30 p.m. I'm going to start my number line at 2 p.m., okay? So I'm going to put 2 p.m. here. I'm going to jump by what? One, One hour. hour. So one hour gives me what time now? Three, Three o'clock. Three o'clock p.m. Do I stop or keep going? Keep going. I'm gonna drop, jump one hour. Again, that gives me what time? Four o'clock p.m. Four o'clock p.m. Do I stop or keep going? Keep going. Can I jump another hour? No. That's gonna take me past 4.30. So I have to switch to what now? Minutes. So how many minutes can I jump now? 30. How do you want to jump 30? By 10. By 10. All right, by 10. Here we go. Plus 10. That gives me 4.10. Jump again. That gives me 4.20. Jump again. And that gives me 4.30. Very good. Now, how do I find my answer? By, by counting all the... I have to add up all of the times, right? Mm -hmm. So that's one, two, that's two hours right here, right? So we have two hours in total right here. Now let's count our minutes. Let's go. 10, 20, 30. So in total here, we have 30 minutes. So now we have two hours plus 30 minutes. So that's two hours and 30 
minutes. Got it? Yes. yes. All right, class, let's try one more example of elapsed time. Let's read it. Madison had a hair appointment at 6 45 p.m. The time is now 5 15 p.m. How long until Madison's hair appointment? What numbers are we working with here? Yes. 6.45 and 5.15 p.m. 6.45 and 5.15 p.m. What's my question? How long until Madison's hair appointment? Very good. On my number line, where do I start? You start at the beginning of the 5.15. Yes, we start at the beginning, but at what number? 5.15. Very good. 5.15 p.m. Now that we've stopped at 6.15, can I jump another hour? No. So what should I jump by now? Minutes. I should jump by minutes. Should we jump by fives? Yes. All right, here we go. So we're at 6.15. What is five minutes from there? 20. 6, 6.20. 20. 6.20. Good. Now I'm at 6.20. Five minutes from there. 6.25. Very good. That's going to be 6.25. Do I stop or keep going? Keep going. So I'll jump five again. What's that next? 6.30. 6.30. Good. Do I stop or keep going? Keep going. So I'll jump five again. 6.35. 6.35. If I jump five again, that's 6.40. And then I jump five again, 6.45. Very good. Now I'm going to, I have one hour. Now I'm going to add up all of these here. Ready? By fives. Here we go. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So now we have plus 30 here. So to answer our question, how long until Madison's hair appointment, we have one hour and 30 minutes.